This is another challenging workout that you can use either at home or in the gym. I've added some plyometric exercises in here to get a little more explosive power and strength out of this. So also get your heart rate up more as well. So this is great for calorie and fat burning. It'll start with plyometric push-ups, which as we discussed before, you can start up the top, come down to the ground, explode up from your push-up, or you can integrate a clap in as well, catching yourself, letting your chest hit the ground first and coming back up. After the plyometric push-up, we're gonna throw in a more difficult plank here. So we'll go spidey plank, elbow out to our knee, or knee out to our elbow, and back down for the reps or time you designate, same with the push-ups. After that, we're gonna go explosive quadriceps. We're gonna come over to our box, bench, stool, whatever secure service that you have at home. Here we go, box jump, soft landing, back down and back down for the designated time period. Make sure that you step off the box instead of jump off the box. We wanna make, make sure we take care of our calves on this exercise for reps of time here as well. Next, we can either go strap rows or if you don't have a pair of TRX straps at home and you wanna go back to the backpack gallon row or if, you've got, if you do have dumbbells and kettlebells at home, we can go back to the bent over row or if you want to go more advanced, this is intended, we'll go pull-ups from your at-home pull-up bar. So you just grab onto the bar, overhand, pull-ups. Try to get your chin above the bar if you can. And lastly, for our last plyometric exercise, we'll go jumping lunges. So explode up, switch, easy back down. Up, switch, easy back down. It's very important for the jumping lunges that you make sure to get the same rep count on each leg or go for the same amount of time on each leg so that you have even workloads on each side.